Hi everyone, I just wanted to show you before it goes on eBay what I've finished the bio chamber moving bed filter box on. So today I've been to Swell UK and got the remainder of the tank connectors that I need to finish off. So on the other video we had a few holes there. Now I'll explain it now you can visually see it. So because this is a water tank, uh, a plumber style loft one, it had one, two, three um attachments so i think we had a couple of valves and then a tap there so i've cut them out can use that one as an overflow can use that one as the waste valve but then that one sort of in the middle i thought what can i do with it so i put a tank connector on with an end cap which got a rubber seal on so that's watertight now but because of the other side it just looks like looks a bit odd in the middle i've adapted it so it's covered up We've got the two inch outlet there. So if I show you on the other side. So this is what I was making yesterday. So basically I've used that inch and a half um, tank connector just to fix the top of that onto. So let me just move this. There you go. Looks a bit better, that looks like it's floating. So it's a bit more secure. I'll just take it off. So, how have I adapted it? A two inch to an inch and a half adapter, two inch 90 degree elbow, the strainer that I made yesterday, and then this is, so I had that yesterday, and these two bits. So, two inch connector, Bit of pipe there. Happy days. There's the strainer for the inch and a half waste. And if I bring you on to this side the inlet. So the idea for this was like say a K1 moving bed. So obviously it can't get out that way. We want something for it this side. So I've got a three inch rubber cap took the, the clip off it. Now, if you remember my, uh, my sieve I made in the garden, I've got rid of that because it just didn't work. It was just a mess. So I've ripped it out now of that. And I used the lid to make that mesh there. So no media can backfill. There we go. So that's it. If you want a YouTube famous pond filter, this will be going on eBay in a bit. I'll put a link on the description. I'll even sign it and autograph it for you. How's that? No, I'm only joking. But yeah, I wish I could have used it myself. It's just I need a sieve before this. And I've I've not got it's it means doing a lot of work to my pond and I just don't have the dough at the minute to do that. So yeah, buy this and you buy us ten thousand nappies and a few wipes for the baby. Okay, cheers for watching guys. See you later.